Hi and welcome in today's video we will be talking about NFT survival mansion game. This video is not a financial advice. This video is just for educational and entertainment purpose only so please do your own research. All the links are mentioned in the description box below. Without further ado, let's get into it. All right, so this is the website of NFT Survival Mansion. You can access it by going to survivalmansion.io. So essentially, it is a game that is developed by Unity using the WebGL. And over here, players out there will be able to experience the game from the first stage. They will be able to develop in single player mode in a third person, and they can also plan a multiplayer release in future implementations. And the Survival Mansion life system would control the lifespan of every NFT out there, and therefore it would ensure sure that there will be even distribution of the prizes among all the winners out there. It runs on build PC and Android using utility programming with the backend which would be connected to web3.js API for any sort of transaction interaction between smart contracts. Here is a bit of overview about what you can expect in the game. A little bit about the goal as a company is to bring the play to earn game format to millions of people out there, but they want to do it in a bit of different style, meaning that they want the players out there to be the driving factor for every update that they make. And they're kind of tired of so many promises and victims from people who kind of just want to play with the money of the players. And the most important mission in this NFT gaming is is to have that game fully developed so that the players can join their network as well. Also, their roadmap would be reflected in the number of players, not the number of dates. The special feature that this NFT has is that your lifespan shall increase your stats in terms of the reward you receive. And therefore, the longer you stay in the game, the higher rewards you shall receive. And here's a bit about the team of the company. So they have game developers, blockchain professionals and leaders in various fields. They are basically based in Brazil, Taiwan and France. And we have Herman. Schmidt, who is the CEO and the founder of the company. We have Jao, who is a lead developer. We have Milton, who is a lead project manager. We have Manuel, who is a lead game designer as well. We have Murilo, who is lead in marketing. We have Paulo, who is a creative director. So that's good to know about the people working behind the project because it gives some really nice perspective. The token that will be used in this game is the dollar SMS, which would have a total supply of a approximately these many tokens. The pre-sale of the NFT will be in BNB when the token is launched on PancakeSwap.Finance and players out there will be able to buy NFTs with the dollar SMS token. They will also have access to the game from the launch of the website where you can familiarize yourself with the game as many more players would join. Here's the roadmap of the company. The quarter one was creating initial prototype, the blockchain tokenomics, ecosystem structure, the design, art direction, story design, lore and mechanics, web launch, launching of social networks, implementation, testing of PVP mechanics. In the second quarter, the focus will be on private round, dollar SMS token, selling the NFT, PVE, pre-production and game testing, in smart contracts, smart contract design, launching Maniate, YouTube and doing influencer marketing. In quarter three, the focus will be on the public round, dollar SMS token, it will be listed on PancakeSwap.Finance, there will be launching of play to earn game as well and pvp when it comes to the sms token it will be created in a way that it is kind of scarce and it will be audited by certic which is one of the largest auditing companies in the market before that token is listed on pancake swap the basic standards would be adopted as they are adopted by major exchanges today and not just that this token will also play a very important role in the nft survival mansion ecosystem which consists of like purchasing chairs collaborating directly with the reward pool on permanent basis staking serving users and supporting systematic growth. Here's the tokenomics of the company which shows the distribution of the token and what to expect from it. So 5% of that would be kept for liquidity, 10% would be available for public pre-sale, 10% would be kept for private sale, 3% for developers, 3% for developers too, 44% would be kept as a pool reward, 10% is for staking, 8% is marketing, 5% is for reservations, 2% is for treasury. So here's an overview of the utilities NFTs so you can see different levels of survivors and different kind of nfts that they would have that you can purchase and exchange in the game 
they also have an airdrop going on where you can get hundred dollar sms token currently they have received 3965 entries 31 days are remaining so there are six ways you can enter it you can do it through wallet you can join them on telegram you can also follow them on twitter once you do that and if you win this airdrop you can get hundred dollar sms in your account so that's really cool something worth checking out and here is their discord page which you have to join to participate in the airdrop you just have to click accept invite and follow the next steps and over here you will stay communicated about the new updates happening with the project and this is the twitter page of the nft survival mansion currently they do have following of 321 people it's very very new still in its early stages worth checking out so that's it overall the idea of using nft to create this gaming concept and having their own currency that they can use within the game is really really cool and i feel that this project does have potential to scale in future definitely check it out links are mentioned in the description box below thank you so much for watching and i shall see you guys in my next one till then take care bye